Gunfire erupts outside an Arlington strip mall, leaving one man dead. And it marks the third violent shooting on Merrill Road in less than 60 days. Police say just before 2 this afternoon, someone pulled the trigger on a man in his 20s near the 24-hour coin laundry near Red Oak Drive. And the gunman is still on the run tonight. News 4 Jacks reporter Corley Peel is joining us live tonight after talking to Arlington residents about the uptick in crime in their neighborhood. Corley. Many people I spoke with say they're worried for their safety because of the recent crime near Merrill Road. I spoke with one couple who says they're even considering moving. A First Coast Crime Stopper sign is stuck in the ground outside a 24-hour coin laundry where police say someone shot and killed a man Tuesday afternoon. Lisa and Daniel Davidson say the crime in their neighborhood is getting out of hand. I'd say the last 10 years, it's went downhill bad bad down here. I'm about ready to move. Records show three dangerous crimes have happened on Merrill Road in the past two months. Along with Tuesday's deadly shooting less than a mile away from the strip mall, a Metro PCS employee shot an armed robbery suspect roughly three days before, according to police. Nearly a mile and a half from that location, police say bullets hit a credit union following a shootout. I just think it's an isolated incident. I don't feel threatened. In the past four weeks, JSO's crime map shows 18 crimes have been reported within a mile radius of the laundromat. Those include armed robberies, assaults, and burglaries. Davidson says he's taken extra measures to protect his family because of the crime. I've had to go get a security system. I had to buy guns. I mean, it's just got to that situation to protect yourself. If the crime doesn't go down, Davidson says he and his wife will be finding a new place to live. JSO says they are talking to witnesses from today's shooting at the laundromat. They don't have any suspects names, so if you know anything about this crime, you're urged to call Crime Stoppers. Reporting live from JSO, Corley Peel, Channel 4, The Local Station.